First of all, I would agree very much with the idea that uh, humanity has a lot to learn from the experiences of China in the last 40 to 50 years, no? since the reform and opening up, uh, the, the eradication and alleviation of absolute poverty uh, in China is a critical uh, experience for the rest of the world and for other regions such as Latin America and for countries such as Mexico. No, I would fully agree that economic development is probably the most important topic. Uh, and making this more concrete, economic development going beyond quantity and highlighting the issue of quality of development, no? And on the other hand, highlighting also the importance of infrastructure. I think both issues, more quality, less quantity, more infrastructure, is fundamental for other regions of the world in terms of a learning process. Uh, and what does this mean for a country such as Mexico as part of Latin America, as you uh, uh, asked? No? So the situation in Latin America, according to, I remind you, institutions such as ECLAC, the Economic Commission for, uh, for Latin America and the Caribbean, they they highlight that in 2022, uh, you still have almost one third of the population living under absolute poverty, 2022. So again, the eradication of poverty is a fundamental economic development goal. Very difficult. I unfortunately believe uh, it will be uh, not only difficult, but practically impossible to be achieved in uh, 2030. Even for bigger countries such as Argentina, Brazil, including Mexico. As a matter of fact, in the last three years since COVID, uh, absolute poverty has increased. In the case of Mexico, only last year by almost two million inhabitants. No, uh, so uh, the lack of growth. Uh, but particularly the lack of economic development and the lack of uh, spending more in infrastructure uh, has become an important limitation uh, to decrease uh, 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 and uh, 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 alleviate uh, and eradicate absolute poverty under the current COVID-19 pandemic. No?